a few things I throw in there. Um, I'll start with that last one, the associations. It's 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 not funny. I don't know the right way to describe it, but as we're recruiting uh, new advisors to try and join Advisors Excel, the hardest thing for us to explain to them is that 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 you're coming into this community of other just massively successful you know, business owners who happen to be financial advisors. And we're very purposeful in creating these experiences where you come together with them. And it's, um, but it's, if I were to look back, like we just had a recruiting event and an advisor asked me like, what's the one thing you guys do better? What's, you know, we've had a lot of growth. What's the number one thing you would attribute to? I said like, just come together once a quarter and being with all these uber successful advisors and learning from them. It's, it's hard to put it in a tangible, like I can't show you a new, fancy website and say it was that in this lead gen thing, but it really is that the associations are so, so important. And I think it's why we saw ended up seeing so many advisors have record years last year, because after those first few weeks, when everyone wasn't sure what, what was going to happen, all of a sudden it's like, well, we better figure it out and might as well figure it out together and share what's working for us. So that was, yeah, a big you one. know, Jim, Jim Rohn explained it to me this way. He said, you know, associations are subtle and deceptive and uh, they don't, the problem is they don't shove you in a direction. It's just mm -hmm. ever so slightly. So it's like, it's like being in an inner tube on a lake and you think that you're sitting there still. And then all of a sudden you look up, you know, half hour later and you're, you're a mile down, down the, the, the beach. So you'd never knew that you were moving at all. And that's the, uh, effect the associations have in your life in either direction. Like negative associations can also push you so subtly and deceptively in a direction and positive associations, you don't even know how you're being uplifted, yep. how it's shaping your perspective. It's giving you different context. It's giving you different reference points. And it's so it's setting a different bar for you in a way that you're not even conscious of. So subtle and deceptive is the powerful influence. And I think I've quoted many times before that David McClellan, who studied uh, human performance at Harvard University for 25 years said the number one factor for significant success comes down to your reference point, meaning your association. The number one out of everything he's ever studied in 25 years at Harvard is your reference point. And so um, it's powerful, but it's subtle. Like you said, it's hard to point yep. to, but it is unbelievably influencing. <laughs>